Hello, one and all, and welcome back to Metroid Dread. In case you missed the last episode, just catch up. Catch up on the series. I swear to you, shit has been hitting the fan repeatedly over the course of the last, like, four or five episodes now. I fight Kraid. I go to Ferenia. I find a, a actual peaceful living Chozo. And now... Now I've let out the X-Parasites! They were nice and, and secure and safe and not bothering anybody in this fucking vault. And of course, I just let them out. Hey, yeah, fly! Be free, X! So now what? If I ever get to fight Ravenbeak, is he is he even gonna be like like Ravenbeak, or is he gonna be Ravenbeak X? <laughs> Important questions. Let's head back to Gavarin. Um, yeah. In case you missed the last episode, lots of stuff happened. Uh, just stay up to date at this point is all I can say. I don't know. I don't know. Things things have. <laughs> accelerated to a degree that I was not quite expecting. The game has definitely picked up in pace. I mean, maybe it never let up on pace. Maybe I was just losing pace because I suck ass at Emmys. Hello, X? What did you just infect? Oh no. Oh no, don't, don't make him turn it back on. Fucking I saw that. I saw you turn that thing to ice. Yeah, you got the ice beam. What the hell? What the hell? Things just keep on going. So, <laughs> Quiet Robe has been infected. His corpse has been desecrated. Oh, that's... <laughs> and it even changes colors. That's pretty cool. Wow, they're pretty relentless. Pretty fast. I always liked that part of uh, Samus Returns. How you see that Hornode um, get infected and it actually changes colors into that really discolored, grotesque version that you would always see in, in Fusion. Yeah, yeah, it looks like these bastards are just everywhere now. Hey, Adam! We fucked up! We they fucked up! Released from their confinement. They have now scattered across the planet. This is no doubt the work of Raven B. Are you sure? It seemed like they were nice and secure until I let them out. Could I have found the plasma beam some other way? Could the Federation have sent it to me like they didn't do in, uh, in Fusion? Please? Hello, Adam? Help? His motives are still a mystery. But your Metroid DNA grants you immunity to the X parasites. You can even absorb them. Perhaps it was some kind of message. Regardless, the X are here. They are overrunning the planet. They must be destroyed. Hurry to your ship, Samus. There's one problem, Adam. I'm willing to bet that there's three Emmy in between me and my fucking ship. And that's not good. I trust you will make it here safely. 
Are you gonna ask me any objections? Cause I have some fucking objections, my man. Seriously, I've got many objections. Adam, piss ant. Oh no. Well, it that's actually pretty cool. Like really, really mini X parasites. Wish I had the space jump. Um. Yeah, the enemy are back. Are you gonna warn me? Do you care? Do you know? Okay. Not a particularly big area, it looks like. Of course, there is the fucking central unit. slow. Uh, it's kind of following me and I really don't like that. Shit. Yeah, I guess the name of the game when you're trying to recharge Aeon is to uh, move around. Alright, where are you gonna go? hell am I supposed to do here? How, how do I... It seems to be nut-hugging this particular bottleneck. And I can't get to it. Right, maybe maybe this way. Oh, shit, we've got a plasma beam door there, too. Alright, let, let me escape the area so that I save and, uh... I don't know, maybe... Uh. Oh shit, oh shit, I've alerted it. Um, yeah, if that fucker has the ice beam, that's not good, actually, now that I think about it. The various suit should keep you, like, it did infusion. It should keep you from getting too fucked up by ice, but yet I'm still getting screwed over by cold areas here. I don't know. Got a underwater zone. Uh, this looks problematic. Uh, can I? No, no, I already know that I can't really bomb jump down here. Gravity suit it is, I guess. Am I gonna get that soon? Be nice if I could, please. Gravity suit! I'm so tired of this water shit by now. God, I am just bobbing and weaving in and out of this Emmy zone. I don't want to go back in. Yeah, I can. Pardon me as I sneeze again. Map? Okay, fair enough. That means that I'm gonna have to go back through the Emmy zone, though. Hello, Emmy! You should paint me blue! You, 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 you should paint me blue! <laughs> Can you imagine somebody, like, getting a whole, like, 
seven of these fucking Emmys, Emmy Amiibos, and then just individually painting them all just so that you can have like a full collection of Samus Return, uh, not Samus Returns, uh, Metroid Dread Amiibo. Uh, still too early to save. Don't want to save. Want to make sure that the, that the recording goes okay. Because if I save and the recording goes tits up, I'm fucked. I'll have to replay through the entire fucking game. And it occurs to me that I should make a duplicate save file when I start for that very reason, but I'm lazy, so. <laughs> what can I tell ya? Okay! Hi, Emily! Looks like I am heading towards that fucking central unit, though, which is nice. Oh shit, oh shit, she's coming! I'm okay. What you really need to do in that situation is see your energy. I'm finally figuring this out. You need to see your energy as a resource. Because the Emmy? Don't give a fuck how many energy tanks that you have. You'll be dead. So if you have to drain your, ener your energy tanks a little bit, it's a small price to pay to fucking get you through without dying. Um, and then that fucking Emmy valve just taunting me. Looks like I'm going up and around. Alright. No big deal. Kind of an odd little underwater nook there. What's with these flashing buoys? I've seen these things before. What are they for? What is their purpose? All right, which way do I go? I got a grapple door, I've got a power beam door. Let's do power beam. Uh, I've chosen poorly. Chosen incorrectly. I've chosen incorrectly. Just leave, 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 leave. Oh, and there's a little respawning area of enemies. For me to fill back up on. Okay, so grapple beam door it is. Maybe. No, no, it's not. Entirely different section now. These bastards move so fast. The second you even remotely alert them to your presence, you are fucked. All right. Shit, I'm doing it again. No, God. didn't even play the alert music! It was still playing the spoopy music. Had to happen! It happens at least once on every fucking Emmy ever. I'm surprised it didn't happen sooner. Okay, Bluey. I really don't like you. if it happens well I'm not I'm too fucking lazy to edit shit so there's no death montage gonna happen oh shit yeah. oh thank you okay Get out of the way. Move, move, move. For the love of God, move. Shit. I had no A in there. Shit, it did freeze me. Fuck you. God. Leave me alone. 
Fuck you, bitch! Ho! Oh. Fuck! So it does freeze you, or it kind of does for a little bit. It always looks like it's so close. Oh, you're you're about to enter. Just go up. It'll be right there. Nope. You're gonna have to bob and weave up and down and all around. Do, 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 do. Up and down and all around. I have no other explanation for this. These fucking Emmys. I love them, but I'm I'm really. Oh, hello. It, I don't have the right mindset for this type of gameplay. I've never like done survival horror or anything like that before in my life. I, I, well, I mean, Resident Evil 4. But can you really count that as survival horror? That's a good question. Answer in the comments! Do you count Resident Evil 4 as survival horror? Ah, I hit the wrong button. How are you supposed to grapple beam that if goes away immediately because you've got to actually take time to grapple that you know, like well no not like that you can't it is so cool like the grappling the, the grapple beam just the whole spider-man effect that you've got going on I'm pretty sure this is how it worked in Samus Returns as well and it was as cool then as it's cool now so Big ups. Big ups. Yeah, that's, uh... That grappling beam, or grapple beam block has got to be, like, the fucking upgrade in this little sector. No savey. Hello? Weren't you that boss that I faced earlier? Aren't you? If you aren't, you're really fucking close, I'll tell you that much. Chonky boy. Chonky boy! Alright, it looks like at least I'm going away from the Emmy zone for right now. I'm able to go back to some traditional me fucking crumbling blocks. Um, some traditional Metroid gameplay. I'm not entirely unconvinced that I'm not about to get the space jump. It, it, it seems too early. But I don't know. Screw attack? It's got the S. Me up, up, I say. Oh, fuck. I don't want the ice beam yet. That's got to be what it is, right? There, it's an on fire fungus. So, ice beam sounds like the name of the game. I guess I'm gonna take a dip. Back into these weird, buoyed underwater crevices. Teleport, I say. Space jump? Spin boost? What the hell is that? It's a double jump! Okay, wow! Allow Samus to jump once more during a spin jump. That's... That's a really interesting way to, to get rid of the high jump boots. Press B at the right time during a spin jump. When used underwater, Samus cannot gain more height over the first jump without the gravity suit. But she can use it underwater? Got a 
say it, it feels pretty good. But what do you mean when you use it underwater? So it gives you just a tad bit more distance. Excuse me as I sneeze again! One of these times my mic is gonna fail to mute like it sometimes does and I'll just bleh. I guess it's better than snorting and farting into the mic, mic right Dave? Um, yeah, that's a really weird way of doing it. It's like, um, so it still works, but its functionality is completely different. Like, you, you jump and it's just like, <laughs> Very awkward, but not the worst thing. I mean, pretty cool. Original way to take on the uh, the high jump boots. That's all I'll say about that. Pretty nice, pretty nice. You're, you're taunting me with that teleporter. You're killing me, Smalls. Please don't do that. Killing is bad. Oh, come on. You could pull it. You'd have the leverage, Samus. You're strong enough to do it. What the hell? Okay, well, at least I can get up here now. That's like classic video game double jump right there. I like it. Another one of you bastards! Use the flash ship. It helps. For the love of God, it helps. Alright, you got your little, uh, sludge wave. Which is totally better than Sludge Bomb. Don't forget. ability is really fucking good for making a huge distance really quickly. Oh, bad timing on that. Okay, so it's not automatic. Keep moving, keep moving. I did it again! Okay. Die! Give me, I say. I'm not even gonna grace you with a take that, you fuck. Even though I just said it. Um, you're a fucking mini boss, clearly. So, get out of my sight. Leave me be, Chozo soldier. That's it. it's not a. Don't call it a boss. That's an insult to the term boss. So spin boost, huh? Double jump. I kind of like it. I wonder if I could... Oh, shit. Oh, shit on me. Die. Die quickly. So I can... Well, I already knew. So... It, it doesn't even look like you have enough time on the fucking pedals. Just enough time. Okay, good, perfect. What's in it? Energy part? Three out of four. Three out of four is good. It means the next one's actually gonna do something for me. Uh, can't go this way because it's a flower fungus or fire fungus. 
fucking fire mushroom piss off. Leave me alone. How the fuck does fire and fungus work like that? It shouldn't. Oh, damn you. So kind of like the space jump, the, the timing of it seems to be just a smidge on the wonky side. Ooh, not good, not good. Um, but I can just... Back to the Emmy. Back to formula. Oh, fuck. It's right there. Oh, hell no! Fuck! <laughs> Leave me the hell alone! Don't want to see you. Don't want to acknowledge your existence, Emmy. Uh... Oh, God damn it. Oh. Ooh. Am I about to go kill its mama? Am I about to go kill its mother brain? Looks like it. Ow. Oh. Go away! Let me absorb you. I will absorb you and obtain perfection. Yeah, uh, it's perfect cell. Samus is not. All right, we're we're clearly approaching this bitch finally. not here? Oh, no, it's definitely here. We kill your mama. There we go. Time for you to die. Especially since this thing has the ice beam. Oh. I mean, what, what, seriously, what else could it have if it doesn't have the ice beam, right? I guess maybe ice missiles, but it's it's obviously something ice-related. Because it fucking freezes you just by looking at you. Which is nuts. <sighs> let's go. Samus, let's blow this thing to next week. That sounds so fucking lame. Omega Stream! Omega Cannon! Yes, it is actually, you know, in typical Dragon Ball Z format. It is customary to actually say the name of the attack. Yes, trust me. It is. It doesn't work as effectively if you don't. Alright. Where you at, bitch? I want actually. Hang on, hang on, hang on. This is actually a great spot. Great straightaway. Eat, eat, eat. No shit, 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 shit. I thought I had it. I thought I had it. I got greedy. I should have looped back around. It's okay. It's okay. Um, it was a good plan. Just, I fucked up. That's all there is to it. Um, I don't think that there's any better straightaway to really do this, though. Make 
sure it's not gonna come up right underneath me on the map. Okay, it's down there. Cool. Shoot it, shoot it. Oh god, oh god. You, you gotta actually hit it to slow it down. Do it! Alright. Let's lure it back over. Do the thing again. Shit! Oh my god. Uh. Oh shit. Take that, you fuck! Holy shit, that was close. I saw it coming back around. I was like, oh no, it's gonna pop up right in front of me. Your soul is mine. <laughs> ice beam? Ice missile? Ice something? Ice bomb? Ice missile. Oh, I should have known because she's got the fucking Metroid DNA. <sighs> but what difference does it make if it's an ice missile or an ice beam? They never really explained this very much in the uh, in Metroid Fusion. I mean, they just said, well, we're just going to give you ice in your missiles instead of ice in your beam. It's like they both fire out of the fucking cannon. <laughs> what difference does it make? Oh, man. Okay. Uh, missiles upgraded with the ability to freeze targets. Hold to fire. Press to fire. So we got super missile, then ice missile. We're going to get diffusion missiles? Well, we've already got a diffusion beam, so but it's not as cool as the diffusion missiles. All right, it's dead, it's done, it's over with. Dead Emmy is best Emmy. The only good Emmy is a dead Emmy. Sorry, Emily, I love you. No, you do not. You shot me in the fucking face. You heartless bastard. It's okay, I mean, I was just gonna... You, you were gonna extract my DNA 50 billion times if I didn't, so whatever. You gotta give and take a little bit here, Emily. Alright, full on energy tank? Yeah! There we go. So it's so hard for me to for me to process this idea. I'm trying to. But when you're in an Emmy zone, the only real enemy there, well, you've got like bombs and those weird little you know, things that hover in place. But the only thing there that's going to kill you is the Emmy itself. And it doesn't matter if you have one energy or if, ma if you're on max energy. So the energy tank is actually a, a really good resource to use. Even after you run out of A and it doesn't matter. You should still be using your, your um, phantom cloak. Oh, come on. An unknown resource has, has been acquired. You cannot use this item yet. Piss off with that. I don't want to hear it. I know what it is. Samus has collected it before. This isn't like fucking Zero Mission when it's just incompatible with your suit because your suit's a noob suit. You're not using a noob suit. You're using an awesome suit that had a bunch of shit in it before. Come on, Sammy. You gotta get out of this bush league habit of yours. All right, so crumbly blocks. Before time began, there was the All Spark. Yeah, I know. I, I used this joke already. New A ability? What do we got? What do we got? Oh, okay. So we actually do have a returning ability. The Pulse Radar. Cool. All right. I know how this works. Um... An A and ability that allows Samus to scan her surroundings for hidden blocks using a special sound wave. With full A and hold right. Oh, on, on the on the pad. Okay. So it looked like a play button for a second, but no, it's right on the. Uh, consumes the full A and gauge to use. Not a big deal. Cool little Chozo statue with an offering. I wish you could like. 
It looks like you should be able to just go into their hand and do dumb shit. Ooh! That actually looks really sweet. Um, like the... The constant pulses going in and out of in the background. That's a stylish looking effect. It wasn't nearly that cool looking in Samus Return, but I mean, of course it wasn't. It was 3DS, and this is DS. Or, <laughs> this is DS! Yeah, that's exactly what this is. Uh, no, this is... That was 3DS, and this is Switch. Fuck you, crumbly blocks! Alright. So... I've got this now. I've got this grappling beam door. I I want to get into that, but I don't know. <sighs> where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Um. Hmm. Again, sneezy, dude! Stop sneezing. It's fucking embarrassing. Um. Because if I go down here. Oh, this. No, no, this is where I want to go. This is where I want to go. Got it. Makes sense. Uh, but I don't want to go all the way down because if I do, it's just going to take me to where I got the spin boost. So. Starting to make a little bit of sense. Out of my sight, fiery, farting fungus. Back to, uh, back to formula? Back to, uh, Elun? Or Ellen? Back to formula. Oh, um, uh, for Ferenia, yeah. Back to Ferenia. Okay, cool. We get to go back to, well... The cool Chozo area, not the graveyard Chozo area that's been overrun by X, but I guess it really doesn't matter now because they already fucking infected Quiet Robe's body. Nothing is sacred to these fucking parasites. They're awful. They're disgusting creatures. <sighs> Horrible. Nasty. Nasty. It's squishy, too. Fuck that. Don't understand them. And it, 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 when it was in his body, it said, I'm counting on you. And it reactivated, I'm presuming all of the Emmy, but specifically it reactivated the one that was right next to me with the ice. So was it trying to say, hey, freeze the Metroid girl and get rid of her so that we can thrive because she's our only fucking predator right now? This place is fucking tremendous. I, I know I've used like the, the name Valhalla before, but this is what this reminds me of. It's it's very um I don't even want to say Sky Sanctuary esque. Cause it, it's not even like Sky Sanctuary from, from Fusion. From Fusion, from Echoes. Um I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a Chozo Galactic Federation. And I see that orb there. I want it, but I'm guessing you're not gonna give me access to whatever's in it yet, are you? I, I swear these X are so annoying. They go from one enemy type to the next seamlessly. Is the boost ball in this game? Phantom Cloak, Flash Shift, Pulse Radar. Unless we have like the, the time slowdown ability. Um, 
Um, get your fucking ruddy paws off the door. Curious now. <laughs> awesome! Um, <laughs> shit. Okay, never mind. Maybe the boost ball's not in this game. Uh, show me what that gets me. All right, all right. Why is this a speed boost block? What? I thought I had the right idea. Oh, that doesn't look possible. No, it can't be possible because there's no, like, sloped area that you can regain your momentum on. Fuck! It was stylish and cool, but... Damn it! I had hopes. I had hopes, man. Okay, uh, these green thingies have been annoying me for a while now, too. I had hopes. I had a good feeling. Good feeling that maybe I had figured something out on my own gotten it. I'm happy that the ball spark is back in this game because it's such a cool, like, sort of hidden perk of the shine spark that Zero Mission introduced. So nice, but has not been used since. Okay, navigation room. Good place to stop. What you got to say, Adam? How'd you like my fly ball spark there that did absolutely fucking nothing? This area, Freddy, appears to have been a sanctuary. The Mawkin conducted ceremonies and rituals here. Now it all lies in ruin. Now the Mawkin are the warrior tribe. It was likely destroyed in the chaos following the X's arrival. That would match what Quiet Rogue said. They have turned it into a hive. I have also detected the presence of an unusually powerful X. Unusually powerful? Is it the one possessing Quiet Robe's body? Because that would be a pretty grim little encounter. We call that the Emmy in this area would see through the rain and stun targets with an electric shock. And it's also purple. It's got the wave beam. Clearly. Or the wave something. It's, it's the fucking wave beam. Clearly. My sensors indicate this Emmy has been reactivated. We can assume that Raven Beam is behind this too. Make good use of the phantom bolt and you should have nothing to fear. You son of a bitch! The the enemy in this the enemy in this area has been activated. You told me this now after it's obvious that it's been reactivated, but you didn't tell me that about blue Emmy. Be careful, Samus. Fuck you! Fuck you, Adam! You prick. Alright. I think this is as good a place as any to stop. Um for right now. I'll probably be back to it a little bit later today. Um, God damn. Making all of this progress, doing all of this skillful stuff, like ball spark, well, wasn't hard at all. But as it turns out, ha ha, you stupid bastard. You got a speed booster block that you gotta go through. I have no clue how. None. But thank you all for joining me. It's been a fun little episode. If you do not like this video already, please do so. Smash it! Smash it like I smashed that fucking Emmy! Yeah, you, you, you fucking Emmy bitch! Emily, get out of my sight! Try and... <laughs> Scary ho? Uh, but anyway, yes, obviously, uh, smash the like button. If you're not subscribed already, please do so. And as always, I shall see you all next time.